uh, and that's the directory listing. So I just showed you a lot. Uh, the last section I'll just kind of briefly touch on is third-party applications that we are integrated with. So these apps do a lot of cool stuff for you. So what's happening here is you can actually jump on and you can check out Facebook groups, for example. So let's say that you want um, to grant members of your community, let's say you build a community, you wanna grant members access to a Facebook group. Well, this right here, we've integrated with Facebook groups so that if they are an active paying member of your membership site, then they'll be granted access to the Facebook group. But if they don't pay their bill, or if they cancel, or if they refund, they'll be automatically removed from the Facebook group. So you have a way that this application manages all that for you. So basically it automatically adds and removes members. And, and the other cool thing is that Facebook groups can become overwhelming with all the people that join them. But this tool right here allows you to basically control who's able to come in and join the group. It allows you to basically control that. Let me give you an example right here. If I was to go to uh, one of my groups as an example, let's go to, or let me show you this group here. Um, you know, this is, this is basically a, a group that, a uh, regular group, okay, not a regular, it's a good group. I mean, this guy's group is good. I'm a, I'm a member of it, but this is just a regular group. It's not, it's not done through the application is what I'm saying versus this inner circle right here is my group. So this is inner circle. This is my own group. Look on the right side here. You'll notice add members. The option has been taken away. So nobody can request to join this group. Nobody can uh, add other members. This group is completely locked down to only paying members, okay? Only paying members, right? So this group right here versus, you know, any of the other groups. So like if I go back to that, um, you know, if I go back to that other group right here, look at how a normal group looks. See, add members. See, they can come in there and they can add, anybody can suggest members. I can come in here and suggest all these members if I want. I, you can invite people by email, so members can invite members. People can find this group and they can request to, to join. There's a lot that people can do with regular groups, but with these groups, they're completely locked down, and that's the power of them. They're locked down like this. There's no option, so that allows you to basically control, fully control the um, your groups. This is such a powerful feature. These, these features individually could be their own products and could be sold. That's how powerful they are. I've got the JVZoo Affiliate Grabber. So this thing um, grabs uh, your, if you launch your product on JVZoo, this tool will automatically approve them based on criteria that you set. Okay, we're gonna give you a little extension like this up here. Okay, you can come in and you can set criteria and you could say, uh, you can give like an instant commission keyword. Like I want, if people say the word, you know, uh, amazing grace or something like that, if they put that keyword, when they're approving, then I can automatically give them instant commissions, okay? Or if they have sales more than 500 on JVZ, I'll automatically give them instant commissions. Or, you know, you can add countries that are automatically approved for instant commissions or whatever, right? So you can basically say, okay, if somebody says uh, Amazing Grace and they're from, you know, these five countries, give them instant commissions. Or you go down here to manual commissions and say, okay, look, anybody from Australia, Canada, New Zealand, United Kingdom, or United States, go ahead and give them, approve them automatically for manual commissions. You could say, these are my safe countries. Everybody else I wanna look at. And you might say, okay, um, I've noticed a lot of fraud coming from areas like Vietnam, so I wanna go ahead and automatically deny uh, people from a certain country. So you have the ability to be able to put in all of these things and be able to change and be able to save these settings. And what happens is, then you just go over to JVZoo. Let me, uh, let me go over to like JVZoo uh, as a little example. You go into where people are requesting to, um, to be affiliates uh, for one of your launches, right? So I'm looking right here and what'll happen is, okay, let me go a little bit smaller so you can see. What happens is this tool is running in the background. Let me scroll down fast enough to catch it. Okay, watch, you're gonna watch it in, in, in real time right now. It's, it's going through and it's looking to see if anybody matches that criteria, okay? Now it's not gonna find anybody because I actually have it running on another computer in the background. So it's, it's, it's not gonna find anybody because I'm, I'm already on auto approval. What I do is I have this refresh tool up here, right here, that allows me to refresh like every five minutes and look for any new affiliates to approve, right? So I've got a very cool tool. I have this on a computer that you guys can't see right next to me. What I do is I set this tool to automatically approve anybody from the United States, anybody from Canada on manual commissions, and then the ability to be able to go in here and, uh, and approve people. So what's happening is it's capturing all of this data and it's putting it into my um, smart member site. 
So it's grabbing all that data from my launch. It's putting it all into my affiliates area so I can have my affiliate manager go and contact all of those people like a CRM and go leave notes, go talk to them about the launch, grant them review access if they need it. It's very, very cool what it does. It basically creates, I don't want to give away too much personal information, but it creates a whole entire kind of ledger and it automatically bans people. It automatically approves people. So um, in a future demo, what I'll do is I'll turn that off. I'll turn the affiliate grabber off and I'll basically, or I'll turn it off and then I'll let a few affiliates kind of come in and then I'll run it to show you how it automatically approves certain people, automatically denies certain people. It's just right now, during this whole entire webinar, every single five minutes, it's been fetching new stuff. Again, it builds an entire affiliate database for you. I have like 10,000 potential affiliates now for any launch that I want to do because of this. It's very, very powerful. And then you have JVZoo Payment Gateway. This allows your customers to come in and buy products. And so you come in here, it gives you step-by-step -step instructions on exactly how to install um, and exactly how to be able to uh, put your product up on JVZoo. Very, very detailed. It gives you the links that you're going to want to use, a thank you page, the API page. So what this means, you just copy these. What this means is that if you want to launch, if you want to create a course and launch it on JVZoo, we give you very simple instructions. When you create your product, you just attach this API. When people buy your product on JVZoo, they'll be automatically granted access to your site. Okay, very, very cool, very simple instructions. We show you exactly how to get your buy buttons, everything, super simple. We show you how to set it all up, okay? We do that, we have it all set up for you. Uh, ClickBank, Warrior Plus, I forgot we had Warrior Plus, Zaxa. Look, look at all these merchants. You can feature your product on all of these sites, okay? Or maybe you just wanna sell it directly. You can literally just connect your PayPal account and you can, you can uh, sell directly using PayPal. You can collect instant money directly if anybody ever buys anything on your course or joins your monthly VIP level or anything. Or you can use Stripe. I prefer to use Stripe. Stripe is a very cool thing. It allows a credit card. It's very simple, just like that. And if you want to send emails, we're, uh, we're partnered with SendGrid, as you can connect your SendGrid account. SendGrid is free for 12,000 emails a month, you guys. 12,000 emails a month is absolutely free. And even if you wanted to bump up to 40,000 emails a month, that's only $10 a month. So SendGrid is a great partnership. It allows you to send emails directly here inside of Smart Member. Okay. Uh, Vimeo allows you to connect all your directly import your accounts from Vimeo. So these are just a few of our available apps, and we're going to be growing this over and over.